hello, uh, my name is uh, Muhammad Al Hiawa, uh, Muhammad Al Hiawa in Arabic. Um, I'm a high school student in Utica Academy of Science uh, Charter High School. Uh, I will be graduating this year and I can't wait to be able to um, go into the path of cybersecurity later on in the future and be able to go into college for cybersecurity and, and get a job, hopefully. So basically, I didn't really know what cybersecurity was at first. I happened to stumble upon it um, on accident. Uh, I had no idea what cybersecurity was. I didn't know it was even a job at, before I even, you know, um, took a class uh, in computer science. But, you know, COVID hit and I was looking for some classes to, um, to actually attend and to just, you know, earn some extra credits, college credits while I'm in high school. Uh, and I found this computer science class, you know, simple Python. So I, I took it and I took it with one of my uh, probably favorite teachers in high school. Um, he's still one of my favorite teachers uh, right now since I, I am still taking his classes. Um, but I, I, I learned Python and, you know, it was a very fast paced class, but I think I, I took a liking to it and I, I handled it very well. I enjoyed the class. I loved doing Python. I, I loved, um, you know, writing code. And from there on, uh, we, he, I, I kept taking his classes. I took his cybersecurity class. I took his um, network defense class. I took his internet the security class. You know, uh, I, I just I fell in love with cybersecurity. You know, and it's it's prob it, it is my favorite course to date now. And like from all of the courses that I've ever taken, and. Um, I, I just, I just, um, I, I took a liking to cybersecurity, and and from, uh, hopefully, I, I, I hope to make it my career soon, after I graduate from uh, high school, and hopefully get a diploma in um, or a degree in uh, uh, college. A lot of the questions and a lot of the the skills you need to learn for CCT are are very foundational and base um, for for cybersecurity. I mean, it's it's really important to learn these topics if you want to get into the cyber field. And I think CCT does a great job of um, opening you up to these new uh, skills and these new topics that you learn about. Um, it, it's, it's just really great. Um, found, it builds really great foundational skills. And without these skills, you wouldn't be able to go into the cyber field and know a lot um, and be able to get that job that you might have wanted from the beginning uh, a lot of the topics like ethical hacking are included network defense internet security all that stuff i think is 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 um is very important in uh, in going into the cyber field and cct does a great job of doing that uh, we've studied over 1700 slides uh you know over spanning over 13 chapters and over 85 labs and i think all of those just like really help in you know strengthening um those skills that we have and just keeping us you know up and running with all the cybersecurity knowledge and all the technology that's coming in learning all these domains is really important in your early stages of your career because it helps you build a foundation of you know knowledge and skills that you'll probably need later on in your cybersecurity career and it just helps you build a very well-rounded um uh approach to cybersecurity. um it's it's these domains are super important in going into the field because uh without learning these domains you wouldn't really understand what you're doing um you know cybersecurity is rapidly evolving so uh you you need to know more about this stuff and you you need to research as you're working you know it's it is a job but you're also learning while you're working because you know everything is gonna change sooner or later, uh, maybe in a day, maybe in a week, maybe in a year. Um, it's just it's really good to specialize in these domains and to keep learning these domains. And I think CCT does a really great job of um, you know helping you relearn everything, but also uh, strengthen the what you already know. Um, so renewing this certificate, uh, like every single time you have to renew. It'll just be more knowledge stacked on top, but it also strengthens what you already have.
I think they were really important in helping me pass this exam because they gave me another perspective on how real life situations work. You know, um, they help you understand how these different softwares work, uh, how you could use these different softwares in different situations, learning the mind of an attacker or the mind of a defender, you know, seeing it from each perspective. Uh, not only were they really helpful in passing the exam, since there are 10 simulations in the exam and I, without these labs you wouldn't be able to pass them, but they, they're they just super helpful in um, understanding what you need to do in certain situations and what to use in certain situations. And, and I think without them, um, building a foundation in cybersecurity, you know, it's, it's going to be pretty hard uh, without them. I personally love ethical hacking and I, um, I love learning about new softwares and uh, you know how to use them and I really loved the virus making tools and the Trojan tools and the thief client you know the cane enable all those different tools that were um, you know that can be used in ethical hacking I took a very very uh, big liking to them because, um, you know, going through these labs and going through each situation and understanding how these work and what they do and when to use them, it, it's just, it's, it's really interesting to me. And I, I hope to be able to go into the field of, you know, hopefully penetration testing because it's, it is mostly ethical hacking, of course. And it's just, um, it, it's something that I can, I, I can stick to. Uh, because I, I love that aspect of cybersecurity. I think the capture the flag uh, aspect of this exam and uh, the exercises that we had to do, I think were a, a very great um, you know addition to this test. Uh, if you're going into a let's say uh, a career like penetration testing or anything that has to do with uh, ethical hacking, I, the, these these exercises are, are very important. Because they help you learn techniques, um, they help you, uh, you know, understand new technologies, softwares, uh, help you understand new tools. It's just um, these are really foundational for um, for for going into something like uh, like any uh, pen penetration testing. Uh, let's say, um, I think these these uh, exercises help you. Uh, help you gain some, you know, uh, control when you're under stress. Uh, they help you gain some problem solving skills and, uh, and, and, you know, know what to do in certain situations. And all of these are, are very important in any industry. But cybersecurity is, um, is, is, that t is one of those top industries that would probably be using uh, these, these skills that you need to have. I, and the capture the flag uh, exercises, you know, help strengthen those skills and, and, you know, build a foundation for them. CCT really helped me gain that techni those technical skills that you would need if you're actually in the field. I mean, theory is always great to learn and CCT did have a lot of theory and a lot of concepts that you needed to know, you know, a lot of laws, a lot of um, different things that were more in theory and less technical. Uh, but I think the technical aspect of it was the most important part because if you if you know what something is and you know what to do but you don't know how to do it what's the point of it you know um, it, CCT with the labs you know it, it helped you learn how to you know uh, maneuver in these different situations uh, being able to use these different softwares and being able to uh, learn how to use these different softwares in different um, situations is really important and CCT does that very well with their labs uh, and even on the test with the 10 simulation questions or the 5 simulation questions as many as you get on the test um, being able to know how to use those tools like Kane Enable and the Thief Client uh, were two of my favorite uh, you know password cracking and being able to remotely connect to a, a computer uh, those were my definitely my favorite on that exam. Uh, being able to know what to do in those different situations is really important. Uh, and CCT really does uh, help you build that skill. The CCT program really uh, did prepare me well to, um, you know, be able to go into high level courses and different courses that, you know, take more skill 
to uh, to understand because the uh, the amount of studying we did for the CCT and the amount of things we were exposed to and that we needed to learn um, the basic foundations of cybersecurity up to a couple you know more advanced uh, softwares and more advanced topics being able to know all of that is going to be very very good to have when you're uh, you know in your later career or in your later life if you're in college still um, being able to take those harder classes and knowing and already knowing you know maybe already half the class because you took the certificate or because you studied for the certificate yeah, it's it's really great to, to, to have and I hope that me getting these certificates and and um, being able to learn all these topics while only in high school and I hope that it you know furthers the chance of me getting a job earlier on and being able to 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 go into my passion and my career um, a lot earlier than most people. Our teacher actually is 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 very enthusiastic about the topic of cybersecurity, of course, um, and he's helped us a lot in our exploration in cybersecurity or of cybersecurity. Um, he's you know he's offered us a lot of certifications that you know high, that high schoolers really wouldn't be able to get. Maybe even some college students wouldn't be able to get. We, we started off simple, we started off with a certified secure computer user, then we moved on to network defense essentials, and then this year we took ethical hacking essentials, we took CCT, and recently we all passed Security Plus, and you know, that is a really big um, accomplishment, and I don't think I'd be able to do any of this without our, uh, our teacher, Mr. Shekhar. I really appreciate him. Um, and being able to to have all these certificates you know it's not just about uh showing your skill but having that knowledge and being able to renew that knowledge every time you renew that certificate is is, is just builds a foundation for you and just strengthens your skills and and makes you a better uh you know employee if you are hired yet it's it's just a really great ad and Certificates are very important in the in in cybersecurity. I'd say that I definitely like the simulation questions um, in the exam the most because I, I like doing hands-on things. Uh, I like doing hands-on exercises. If uh, if it's just reading, answering questions, I, it's not really enjoyable to me. I mean, I could do it. I will be able to pass doing it, but being able to do more hands-on than just read and answer. It's just it. It's really it, it makes me more enthusiastic about the topic and the the simulation questions um, on that test really helped me, you know, boost my morale and my mentality while taking that test. It made me excited. Um, I did study a lot for that part for the simulated uh, questions um, with the labs that CCT uh, provided. Uh, without those, obviously, I would not have been able to take that test. And I think it was just a really great add to it, and, and it was definitely my favorite part. I am still uh, a high schooler, of course, um, and I really, I, I don't know how I can use the CCT uh, certificate to be able to help me gain a job. But with with this, obviously, I hope to gain some exposure, and I think it will be a really great help. Uh, to to be able to get a new job, maybe a, a higher salary, of course. Um, and, you know, I'd obviously love to thank EC Council for this opportunity. Without uh, without them, I, um, I wouldn't be able to be able to speak in front of all of these people and uh, be able to, you know, expose myself and hopefully um, to my future employer. Um, I'd love to uh, thank our uh, school for uh, giving us this opportunity to be able to even take these courses and get these uh, exams and take these uh, certificates and get them. Uh, obviously our teacher, Mr. Shekhar, is very, very knowledgeable, very enthusiastic about the topic. He always goes the extra mile for us and without him, I, th I don't think we'd be able to be here and have this knowledge to, to further our careers. Uh, I'd love to obviously uh, thank our superintendent, Dr. Hayali, for letting this program be able to be run and by such a great teacher, uh, Mr. Shekhar. 
um, our Dean of Students, Mr. Ursoy. He's been very helpful throughout this entire uh, um, journey that we've taken to to learn cybersecurity. He's uh, he's even included himself in uh, in most of it as well. He learns with us, and we learn with him. And it, it's just it was such a great um, opportunity to have, and the experience itself. I will definitely miss it uh, when I graduate this year, but. It, it, it was really helpful and I, I, I would like to thank them all for this.